Exercise 3.5, question number 5. Solve 6x to the power 4 minus 35x cube plus 62x square minus 35x plus 6 is equal to 0. Definitely this is a reciprocal equation. 6, 6, minus 35, minus 35 and 62. So signs are same. So it means the type 1. And leading degree is 4. It is an even degree reciprocal equation. So previous, previously in the concept I have taught you that in even degree type 1, what we have to do is we have to make the term as x plus 1 by x or x minus 1 by x. So that's what we are going to do here. We don't have any direct solution. Right. So how to do that I'll explain. Now I'm going to group the first term and the last term since the coefficients are same. And the next two terms, 35, 35 coefficients are same. And the last term. Now, from these two terms, I have taken 6 outside. And from these two terms, I have taken minus 35 outside. Now, this equation is supposed to be divided by x square. So, x to the power is divided by x square. You will get x square. 1 divided by x square is 1 by x square. x cube divided by x square is x. And x divided by x square is 1 by x. Now I have got 1 x plus 1 by x. Similarly, I have to make this term also x plus 1 by x. How to do that? For that, we have to use the completing the square method. Right? How to do that? I will explain. We know that x plus 1 by x the whole square. That is a plus b the whole square formula. I have expanded it as x square plus 1 by x the whole square plus 2 into x into 1 by x. a square plus b square plus 2ab. And x and x is cancelled. So, x square plus 1 by x square plus 2. Now, check here. Here I have x square plus 1 by x square. But if there, if, if there exists a 2, I can simply write here x plus 1 by x the whole square. So, I need a 2 here. Can you understand? To make this term as x plus 1 by x the whole square, I need a 2 here. So, I am adding a 2 and I am subtracting a 2. So, now... Um, you know that this is now a plus b the whole square formulas expansion. So I have used a plus b the whole square. So checking here. So in this place I have substitute x plus 1 by x the whole square. So x plus 1 by x the whole square is substituted. This minus 2 is left as it is. The bracket is very much important. Right. Now what you have to do is in the place of x plus 1 by x I take it as y. So here I have to substitute y. Here also I have to substitute y. So the equation becomes uh, 6 into y square minus 2 minus 35 into y plus 62 is equal to 0. Now take the 6 inside. The equation is expanded. Now this looks like a quadratic equation. Adding these two terms it is 50. This is a quadratic equation. Now I have to solve using the t method. So using t method. 6 into 50 I have written I can write this as minus 15 minus 20 divided by 6y divided by 6y on cancelling it is minus 10 by 36 and on cancelling minus 5 by 2y so 2y minus 5 into 3y minus 10 which is equal to 0 you have got two set of values 2y minus 5 is equal to 0 3y minus 10 is equal to 0 now as it is replace y by x plus 1 by x now it becomes 2x plus 2 by x minus 5. To remove this denominator, I am multiplying by x. So, 2x square minus 5x plus 2 is equal to 0. Again, a quadratic equation using tree method. I can write this as, see, 2 into 2, 4, minus 1, minus 4, divided by 2x, divided by 2x. On cancelling, minus 2 by x. So, I can write as 2x minus 1 into x minus 2, which is equal to 0. So, 2x minus 1 is equal to 0 and x minus 2 is equal to 0. x is equal to 1 by 2 and x is equal to 2. So, 2 values. Now, we'll do the same here also. So, um, replacing y by x plus 1 by x. So, 3x plus 3 by x minus 10 which is equal to 0. To remove the denominator, multiply by x and I have got this quadratic equation. So, using the t method, 3 into 3 is 9. So, it can be written as minus 1, minus 9, divide by 3x, divide by 3x. So, on cancelling, I have got minus 3 by x. So, two sets of value, 3x minus 1, x minus 3. 
which is equal to 0, 3x minus 1 is equal to 0, x is equal to 1 by 3, x minus 3 is equal to 0, x is equal to 3. So, totally 4 roots, 2 and its inverse 1 by 2, 3 and its inverse 1 by 3. Thank you.